today, but we're still editing it, so it's not going to be for a few days. Kind of the timing is off, but yeah, I've got a lot of really, really, really new and completely revamped things that I'm really looking forward to releasing. So if you liked what you saw, yeah. this is all going to go away because it's nothing compared to what's about to come up. One of the one <coughs> of the um, pieces that we're going to see, you're introducing it, and you call the song Mes Amis. Mes Amis, yep. Now is that to me, mes amis means my friends in French, but that's not what you mean. Mes amis is more of a translation okay, of like, gotcha. like new, uh, like it's almost like new beginnings, new paths, new kind of ventures okay. in a way. But may I say something? By the way, sh uh, you do know French, don't you? Well, that's what I thought. She he's speaks saying French. Mes amis, yes. and he's mes amis, yeah, something that would be else. Yeah. So, she speaks okay. French, French fluently. <laughs> and may I say today? I hope I'm not out of order. This is her birthday today. Who's birthday? Mine. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Is there you. anything you can give us in like a, a, a small rendition of <laughs> Oh, goodness. Um, Marva, I don't need anything else. <laughs> I had the best time putting okay. together that piece. Okay. I mean, literally, I'm not. He, uh, four we just wanted to hear one, one really? line yeah. of happy wow. birthday. It was so much fun. It was, I mean, it really <laughs> yeah. did. Thank you. You know, um, one thing that I want to kind of stress to the viewers mm. also is well, I want to ask you first do you have any English language songs? That's one of the songs. Mm. I'm going to be releasing some English. Um, covers mostly mm -hmm. uh, that I did some of the videos that I'm talking about that uh, that I will be releasing one of them uh, I felt like I should do it for my friends that from here that don't understand the language they're kind of right. doing this one for them for yeah so I'll be doing some English you no know, I was saying I but, and I didn't really want you to do anything I just wanted to hear what happy birthday would sound like in acapella like I heard you sing oh goodness she's I going on it sing acapella oh. on the usual like come on he can know. sing one little sentence but wait we have to talk okay. about the other part okay. Okay. the <laughs> important part is just because it's not English doesn't mean that you're not going to fall in love with it. Yes. Like, I have no yes. idea what you're talking about. <laughs> None. Okay? But yeah. I'm, like, in my room, you know? <laughs> yeah. Right. So the, the new stuff will actually have closed captioning. So when, oh, you, when the good. new stuff yeah. pops up, you hit the little <laughs> CC button at the bottom, and you'll see translation. Okay, so that'll help, cool. too. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah. But there were a couple of songs I wanted to What is this song about? But all right. <laughs> can we go to a break and watch sure. the next we one? Can. Okay. Yes. So we're going to go to a break. We hope you stay tuned. We want to see more of Jeffrey Iqbal. Gardena, gardena, tere bina, tere bina, besuadi, besuadi, gardena. 
And we are back. Welcome to From the Heart with Mara Richardson. Um, we're here with uh, some guests. We have Representative uh, uh, Councilman Kelly. We have a performer here, and we are joined by uh, Miss uh, Josie Roy. Miss Miss Roy. Um, I just had another question for Mr. Kelly. You know, I, I I go through a lot of functions out in the city. I run into you a lot, and I just want to commend you uh, for a lot of work you're doing. And I just was wondering, what's if you become mayor, what's one of the first things you're going to do uh, to try to. Uh, you know, help the city. Well, first issues. thing you really have to do, I'll have a 120 day plan. We have to make the city safer. Make we have safe. to make it safer for everybody, for the people who live here, for the seniors, for the young people and the businesses. That's priority number one. Second would be to make sure government works. As I said, when you call and ask for some help, you have a parking ticket, you need some assistance with a special pickup, you have to have that work. And right very close to both of those is education and youth. You know, we have to help our young people out. It's not the 70s and 80s like when we grew up. It's a little bit different. You know, Jeffrey's generation and others few things differently than we do. But that doesn't mean that they all don't need the help that we've given everybody else within the city. Absolutely. It all ties in. It seems like it all goes back to education. You know, the, the more we're educated, the, the less trouble we're in to get better jobs, stay out of prisons, mm -hmm. the whole nine. Exactly. And I was just wondering, uh, uh, my man, here, you saying that uh, you wanted, you didn't want to get boxed in with, with the music. Uh, you know, I know a lot of the uh, winners on American Idol and a lot of these uh, contests, they move on to, like, acting. You, you remind me of an actor. you have any aspirations <laughs> for getting uh, into theater? You know, it's... It would be cool only if it just fell in my lap because it's I think that you, to, to focus in on one thing is is hard enough that if I spread myself so thin to try to get into acting, I think would just be I'd be spinning my wheels in too many different places that I won't get anywhere. Oh, so small, small parts probably wouldn't hurt. <laughs> yeah, small yeah, parts. Yeah, get, get, you, get, get you more exposed. Yeah. And, and Josie, I'm sorry I got your name wrong. I, I lost my thought for a second. Miss Josie Roy is joining us. I don't know how it happened. But <laughs> Josie, did you want to say something? Yeah. First of all, um, it's just an honor to be on the program this afternoon with everyone. And uh, as I was sitting in the green room, I was just listening at, um, you know, the conversations that, was, that were going on. And uh, this young man here, um, he inspired me. Um, I, I heard you, Shona, when you said to him about um, when he did what he did, and he, he said, you know, don't get stuck. Um, he has a vision, he had the vision to continue on. I think that is such an inspiring, inspiring um, uh, an encouragement statement for our young people because they feel like if they get one place, you know, they have to stay there. And uh, to listen to you, to say that, to continue on, to have that vision that you can go anywhere, just like the president says, mm -hmm. uh, you can be anything that you want to be. But I think that was such a, an encouraging statement to our young people that to continue on. If it, just because you done got your plateau wherever you are, that you can continue and do other things. So that was that was wonderful. I, I was I appreciate it. Uh, yeah, that was wonderful. And just listening to uh, all the things that you have done, it, it's just wonderful. And you're such an inspiration. Uh, and that's what we need um, with all the issues that our young people have to uh, deal with today, um, and to see a younger person come. Uh, and to inspire them that they can be somebody to go on and just to look where you came from and where you are now is such a such an inspiration so I'm just glad to sit out and listen and of course it's always good to be with uh, Councilman Kelly uh, and of course I can always I always have, have issues um, that I need <laughs> answered or no that uh, needs to be addressed but one thing, um, Councilman Kelly, that I, I have a concern over and I know you can't do anything about it but you can begin to um, see that something happens that it's taken care of if you notice um, in our newspaper uh, um, I think maybe a week or so ago uh, Senator Carper stated that he was going to look in um, to the denials of Social Security disability for persons that are being denied uh, Social Security um, I have received several calls of people who have been denied uh, Social Security benefits and the percentage rate here is I think uh, 60 or 70 percent. Now we have people that um, 
have serious, serious illnesses, um, and they're being denied one after one, one after one. What can you do or what could you do? Um, I know it, you could do something locally that it would go on down and to begin to address the General Assembly where legislation would be passed or s someone begins to look into the seriousness of this, that something gets done. That's one of my questions for you. And it'll be one of my questions for uh, other persons that seek an election because it's a serious, serious issue and, and it needs to be addressed and something needs to be done about it. But what I would be glad to do is usually in city council, we could do a resolution asking for the congressional uh, delegation to take a look at social security patterns in, this, in Delaware. You're correct, Josie. We have about 60% of the people who are denied, which is a very high percentage. I think Delaware was leading the nation. So sometimes there's one person or one or two people who make these decisions that we need to take a look at because the majority of people applying for Social Security really need it. They're disabled, something is happening in their life where they can't work and they need some assistance from the government. But that's what I would be willing to do and also reach out to Senator Carper and ask him to look into the matter a little bit more. Okay. Well, I, I hope that you maybe would take that on for me. Not a problem. Do I do um, everything you ask? Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> and uh, I have a lot of questions, but we're going to continue yeah. on. Thank you, Marva, for oh, you're so, me. Uh, Listen, Josie is another one of our hosts uh, on From the Heart. Uh, but we, we want to get into this more, but we've asked Mr. Kelly to come back on the first Sunday in uh, April to give him more time with Josie. Jeffrey took host. up all my time. <laughs> <laughs> This well is worth Jeffrey it. Ippel's well worth day. It. Well worth so, it. but we're going to you're, you're going to come back. I'm putting you on. Not I don't want problem. to have to keep calling with long-winded messages. You yeah. know how I am, Jenny. Yeah, I call with them long-winded messages. So he will be back, and we can get him more into this, Josie. Not a problem. In the meantime, Shauna, I went, I always last time we didn't have time to close, so I want to give Mr. Iqbal proper timing to say a few more things where he's going to be, Shauna, and I'm going to give that to you, and we're going to roll it. Okay. Okay. Well, um, let's talk about. The 24th. <coughs> who, who asked you to do that? Uh, actually, the community, in a way. I did a show at the DuPont Theater a um, couple, two, three years back. Um, I'm really annoyed that I missed that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you can come to the 24th <laughs> one. Uh, so the people that went to it, um, they the next year, they said, when are, they, when are you going to do another one? And I just um, haven't had the opportunity to come back to Delaware. And Delaware is my home, mm -hmm. right? So I wanted to kind of do something for friends, family, in my backyard. Um, so many people don't get to travel with me and to see my, my performances, so I wanted to do something in Delaware, and I, and I really wanted to do something special in Delaware. So we've got, um, we've got all sorts of things, uh, more musicians than I normally would perform with. We've got dancers. I'm gonna even try to dance. I was at a dance rehearsal the other day. We this is gonna be interesting. We saw you dancing thing. on that. You, you got some uh, moves. <laughs> <laughs> I don't got that one move, the, the one guy. No, you gotta do it like this. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, so it's just going to be a really good kind of family event. So whether you're really young or you want to bring your kids or you just want to see something that you probably wouldn't get to see in general, um, that's really what that show is about. And, and like I said, music is kind of like it kind of captures all audiences in a way because it's not only about the language. Right. Like you were, you were saying yourself that you might not understand the language, although there will be some English in, in some of the tracks, but it's just the rhythms, it's, it's the feeling, and it's the atmosphere, and, the and then you're gonna see the mm -hmm. lights, the, the costumes, the dancing, it's all gonna come together to be one nice production. So. I, I can't wait, I am so looking forward to Can it. Can I ask you, Craig, I, I, I work for also, like I said, his mother, I work for Dr. Astana, mm -hmm. doc, and then Mrs. Tandon, I saw her not too long ago. Are you still able to see them again? I see them once in a while, at family functions okay. and things like Let that. Let me ask you a question, I'm gonna read this up for myself. Uh, are you familiar with line dancing? The country line dancing? Yes. I've seen oh. it, but I've never done it. Well, there's a young man that just walked in here. He's running for state rep. State rep. That's Councilman Charles Potter. I know he doesn't want to come on, but he can do some mean line dancing. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> and I know he's sitting over there listening, but I just want to let the viewers know this is one of the nicest guys you'll ever want to meet. He and his wife, uh, he's running for state rep, uh, gang, and right now he's Councilman Charles Potter, and I do endorse him. I endorse him because I know him through the years, and I know his wife, and I also would endorse Sam Guy because I've known him through experiences mm -hmm. of my family. So when he walked in, I had to shout that out. So Mr. Potter, if you want to come do a little bit of line dance, <laughs> I'm just teasing, but I do want you to know that uh, uh, Charles Potter, you know, uh, is the one that bring, I come under him through positive images. And I'm really grateful. I've been here now for about four years. And to him, I have to give that honor. With Great. that being said, we want to continue on Shauna, 
Uh, Mr. Jackson, all of you, last moment thoughts in closing, and let Mr. Iqbal have the last say, please. Yeah, where did you say your um, performance is going to be, University of Delaware? It's at University of Delaware uh, Pearson Hall on yeah. March 24th. So I'm sure it's going to be a lot of university students at your show. Hopefully, yeah. And uh, we hope that they all support uh, House Bill 244, keeping kids in school <laughs> so they can get to college as well. Give that link again. What's that link? Uh, it's uh, www.thepetitionsite forward slash one forward slash stay in school. Uh, pretty simple. And we also have a Facebook page too, House Bill uh, 244 on Facebook. So, uh, you know, you can get on there and show some support. And that's my closing argument, uh, Representative or but Just counselor. to follow up with yours, sir, I think you should contact Mr. Wright from the Youth and Education Committee of City Council and come before the committee and give a presentation. You know, we show it to everybody who's in the city of Wilmington. There's a lot of people who watch it. Because, you know, no matter what medium you use, sometimes people just don't know what's going on, maybe because of their own ignorance, you know, not being engaged in the issues. But I'm more than welcome to come on and give that, give that some attention. Absolutely. We'd be glad to. Josie, last moment thoughts. Okay, uh, I just want to say quickly um, for everyone that knows that I've been working on the Hayward Roy D. Roy Jr. Scholarship Fund for the women uh, at Baylor Prison. For those who are uh, coming out of uh, prison uh, who are interested in the culinary arts um, field to continue their education, we are just about there. It's been a lot of work. I want to thank Edie Prison for who has been diligently working along with me. So we're going to celebrate history soon. Pray for us and just keep us in your prayers. I would like to know how many minutes we've got left. We've got about seven minutes. Quick, we yes, we're going to give that time to you. <laughs> yes, we're going to let Shauna Roy <laughs> ask questions and bring out everything we need to know about Mr. Ekbal and then Mr. Ekbal, whatever you... It's yeah, I just want to say one last thing or whatever. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Oh, right now? Yeah. Hello. <laughs> so, for, for those of you that kind of tuned in a little later, we've got a Bollywood show coming up uh, March 24th. Um, to kind of get more information on it and just to keep in touch, Facebook is the best place. I'm going to plug it to you guys. So <laughs> go on Facebook. My name is Jeffrey Iqbal. Um, and you can kind of get more information on the show and what Bollywood is, for those of you that don't know, and, um, and we've got a lot of really, really exciting music coming out. And it's Bollywood is very entertaining. It's so, yeah, it's, it's, it's um, I think that, I think most people have probably seen it, you know, and maybe didn't realize that that's what they were looking at, but it's so colorful and it's so energetic and it's just music and dancing and, and those type of Bollywood productions are it so, is. They, like, aren't they great? There's a lot of dancing going on. <laughs> I, was, I love the dancing yeah. myself. Yeah. Was, can you teach us this Bollywood <laughs> dance? Listen, yeah. Mr. Jackson. Yeah, we'll like do the line dancing, dancing as well. Yeah. Yeah. To do that, that, you could do the other. <laughs> that girl that was in the one clip that had the white pants on that was doing yes. that thing in my room this morning. I can teach you a basic wow. step. Yes, I was. I can teach you a basic step. But here's yeah. the thing. Yeah. All of us have to do it together. Well, we're all mine, so. Okay, all right. So basically, when it comes, if you're ever in a, at a wedding or if you're doing anything with South Asian people, it's it's pretty much in the shoulders. Mm -hmm. If you can go like uh -oh. this, right, and you put your hands up, I'm in trouble so there's one already. one thing, you can <laughs> two fingers up in the air. Mr. Kelly's got it. Mr. Or got it. if yeah. you've ever replaced the light bulb, you just change the light bulb like this on, <laughs> and that's it. And you got to bounce the shoulders, and that's it. Go to a wedding, go to anything, and people would be like, wow, are you Indian? <laughs> <laughs> that's it, huh? All right. That's no really, music. because when you look at those, you see a lot of people doing that. All right. Those clips. Well, and we'll be doing it at your show. Okay. Right. I, I, I do a lot I, of I, jump well. up, you know, because I saw that when I was went at one of the parties, and I was trying to serve and do this, and they were jumping all around <laughs> me, and I just wanted to jump the food elsewhere and hop <laughs> and hip, you know. But you have so much fun. They are just into what they do, and they don't have a care in the world once they start dancing. Yeah. How'd this dance rehearsal go for you that you mentioned? It's been a while <laughs> since I've done like choreographed dancing, so it felt a little unnatural, but I'll, I'll get it by the 24th. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Right. Okay. Yeah, so, okay, so we want to make sure that everyone knows we are going to be at the uni we. Did you see how I put we. myself on stage yes. right there? Yes. Um. <laughs> Jeffrey Iqbal is going to be at the University of Delaware in Pearson Hall. That is um, going to be Saturday the 24th. The program starts at 8 o'clock. Doors open at 7.30. If this is like any type of Bollywood event that I've ever seen, you want to make sure that you are there when the doors open. And 
don't be afraid to get up and dance. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I, I, you know, Marvin, you really surprised me because I'm like, this is going to be a party. It's going to be a, yeah. a, a, a party. Listen, I dare not because I tried to do the line dance at a wedding and I thought I had it. My daughter said, Mom, get out of the way. <laughs> I went they to were going to, I said, they're, they're going to have a riot. My own children wanted me out of the way. That's how bad I was doing. That's so I got to get, so you're going to have no, to kind of. No, no, you're not in the way. The more, it's good. Did you see the, the way the people were dancing? Yes, and you yes, got them, you yes. Know, yes. See, that's why I left those in. What about you, Mr. Kelly, you're saying I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I got some room. I went to Wilmington High, remember? Oh, okay. I forgot that. <laughs> yeah. We have a little bit. That's all. What are you doing between now and the 24th? Uh, just, just preparing, and I've got a lot of that, the videos that I was talking okay. about. We're, we're polishing them up, so all right. getting ready for the release. Is that the only show you're having in Delaware? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's <clears throat> it's usually in random states, but Delaware is. We always do the Delaware show, and it's once every probably other year. Okay, okay, well, we're going to try to get you back a little bit sooner than that. Uh, <laughs> we would love to have you back at back at the Grand. I would have loved. Were you at the Baby Grand or the Big Grand? The Big. No, it wasn't the Grand. It was uh, Dupont. Theater. Oh, Dupont Theater. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Because I I love the Baby Grand, and if we could get you in there, it's small. The only reason I like it because it's small, mm. so it would be like kind of watching you perform like right now, you right, know. Right. But yeah, you should do that. Can you work that out? We should. Yeah, we can definitely Appreciate try. Yeah, Thanks, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Okay, Appreciate we've it. got a few more minutes. I think they're good. We want to close properly. We don't want them to cut us off like they did the last time. One second, <laughs> Mr. Right, Linwood. everybody. This is election season 2012. We want to make sure everybody's registered to vote. If you're not registered, get out there. We're going to try our best on From the Heart to bring you uh, the, the politicians that's in the news and, and to present them to you so you can have informed choice to who you're going to vote for One come second, election season. Okay, I just want to say again, it's just wonderful being here. Um, Make sure um, you be listening to these politicians uh, who's going to represent us and get out. And when you do, make the right choice and vote. One second. Thank you for allowing me on the show today. If you need any additional information, you can go to kellyformayor.com, and that's with an EY. Thank you. Marvin, oh, you got it. I'm good. I got a mic. Yes. <laughs> Actually, I would like to save my time so we can watch some more, Jeffrey. Yes, so do okay. I. With that, viewers, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you again the first and second Sunday of next month with Mr. Kelly, Josie, and some of the others. Please stay tuned. We're going to wa watch some more clips. Sean is at. March 24th. March, we're going to let Sean tell you. Shauna. March 24th, University of Delaware, Pearson Hall, Jeffrey Iqbal. Ticket prices are on the website. You can search for the U University of Delaware website, go to events, and you'll find all the information you need. Continue watching. You don't want to miss this man performing. Thank you, Marva. Yeah, you can check him out on Facebook as well. Yes. Roll it. Google. <laughs> Over to judges. Suresh ji. Very nice. Jeffrey. Fantastic. Kya baat hai. Generally, we don't hear these words from our Suresh ji's mouth, but for you, it's fantastic. Let's ask Adi ji. Mind-blowing. Amazing. Thank you very much. Hardly I don't get to listen to these songs today. It's a very good song. Very good. क्या बात है जेफ्री फैंटास्टिक माइंड ब्लोइंग बहुत ही अच्छा परफॉर्म किया ऑल द बेस्ट जेफ्री इकबाल अगेन हियर हैज गोइंग एवरीवन नाउ वे रिकॉर्डिंग नेइज अमीन दिस इज मोर ऑफ़ द आरएनबीएच टाइप फील सो आई थिंक एंड आई एम ट्राइंग ब्रिंग सम डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ़ साउंड्स टू यू गाइस सो होपफुली गाइस एंजॉय दिस वन एस वेल Okay. 
हैं भर सिंत सारे पहरे टूटे 